All right. Let's get to it. Yeah, we got it. No, that's fine. You can leave it down. Because I'm pulling mine down too. Sleeves down. Because it's kind of chilly today. Mm. Uh. My back hurts. Your back hurts. You don't want to help me with the wood? You do want to help? Yes. Okay, let's stack some wood. Okay. Me and Jim are just going to clean up this wood pile real quick. Brand new sheets. <coughs> Gemma's not feeling real good today. She had a fever last night, but uh, the fever's down right now. So while she's feeling good, we figure we stack a little bit of wood. Yeah. Oh my gosh, Daddy. Hope you guys enjoy. Are you ready? Daddy. Yes. Yeah. Right, let's do it. Uh. Right, you can put them. You can put them up there. Well, not right there. Put them on the stack. In the front. No, not over there, over here. Work straight. Yeah, that's pretty close. Oh, careful. <laughs> Do you want to knock this 
down. Say hi to today. Yes. Yes. A baby, a buddy, dad. Everybody. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Any names? Yes. What names? Dad, Dad, Jesse. Oh, tell the camera. What's it you? What is that? Well, I don't know Huh? Buddy. What's on there? In there. Right there. What is it? Wait. Wait. Right. Yeah, wait. Uh, hi, Dave. Trusty. I'm sure they appreciate that. Do you, have, do you have any other friends that you want to say hi to today? Yeah. Who? Who is me? Grizzly? Yeah. That's me. Who's Grizzly? That's right. Yeah. Yeah, you say hi to me every day. Yeah. put these on my head. Uh, Jimmy, you know those gloves are dirty, right? No. Yeah, look at them. Yeah. yeah. So, Gemma's gloves. I think these are... Well, my wife's calling me. So I'll have to edit this out. What's that? You? Well, mommy was talking to me. What? Mama. I'm calling it. Calling? Yeah. Okay. Mom. Mommy? Yep. Mommy. Okay, let's... Build up this side. What do you think? Build this side up a little bit. So, back to what I was saying. Gemma has some um, Paw Patrol gloves that she likes. Yes. They're actually Nickelodeon brand. Because I guess it's licensed by them. Um, I'm using some Milwaukee's. I've had these for a little bit. They're pretty durable. Gemma's had these for a little bit. You guys saw her using them in the other video. Um, she hasn't gotten any splinters yet that I'm aware of. Did you get any splinters while you were wearing your gloves? Yeah. You did? Yeah. You just kind of agree with me and say yes to everything? Yes. Well, as far as I know, Gemma hasn't gotten any splinters. Um, yes. So if you guys are looking for kid sizes, 
Um, I know Ace Hardware has a pretty good supply of them. I'm not sure about the bigger stores, because I don't typically shop the gloves with them. If you guys have some young ones, I'd like helping you. If any of you guys watch uh, Hard Working Man, he uh, recently got some Milwaukee gloves as well. His are a heavier duty version. These are the uh, Daddy. Cut Daddy. Level 2 smart wipe these are large they're fairly thin uh, fairly good uh, sense of touch and until I wore the tips off because these used to be all black um, I could actually uh, swipe my phone on it your back hurt again buddy you want to go sit are you want me to rub your back again you could actually uh, use your phone without the bubbles bubbles yes okay you can do the bubbles I think your bubbles are still sitting on Take your gloves with you. Thank you. No, take the gloves. Oi! Take your gloves. <laughs> Just put them up there on the deck with you while you're doing your bubbles, okay? Okay. Yeah. Um, they've been pretty durable. Uh, they cost me about the same price as the uh, no-name gloves. Uh, but I've gotten times as much life on them so they work really well but uh, I don't have any of the heavier duty ones I just picked these up to uh, give them a try because the ones I was typically using are the uh, East Hardware brand and uh, the material wears off and starts peeling off pretty pretty quickly uh, but uh, I'll put a link in the description for this video for uh, Hard Working Man. Um, and check him out. He has a uh, splitter that he got a couple weeks ago. Uh, I believe the company is Allwood. Um, pretty, uh, pretty heavy duty splitter he's got. It was actually one of the brands I was looking at before I got the uh, Wolf Ridge. Enjoy watching their videos. I'll be right back. Gentlemen's coming. Yeah, buddy. All right, where was I? Um, yeah, hardworking man uh, and his wife. They're uh, they're pretty enjoyable to watch. Uh, lots of good back and forth banter, and uh, you actually get to see some outtakes too. But the reason why I mentioned him is. I'll be right back. Yeah, Gemma! Crackers? Alright. So, I had to help Gemma real quick. I more or less lost my train of thought. So why do I mention hard working man? Um, basically, he just started using Milwaukee brand gloves in uh, one of his videos and I've not seen very many reviews on any of the Milwaukee gloves and I've found that I rather like them, especially for the for the price. Um, get a bit more durability for about the same amount of money. But he's running a different different model, different type, whatever you want to call it. So, and I also enjoy watching their videos. So, I figured I'd let you guys or help you guys find another source of information and source of entertainment. thought Gemma was going to help me a little bit more, but she's not feeling good. She's easily distracted and she just went inside.
thing on the back wheel that I just pushed up is oh, let us split. At the end of last year, uh, most of it by hand. And some of it with the splitter earlier this year. It's got a long way to go here yet, so I'm not going to be using it this year. So why not stack? This maple pump. So this stuff's actually ready to burn now. That's one of the nice things about maples, the cure time, the season time is so, so short. I think I'm going to move you guys. Stacks leaning out a bit. So, this maple I got shortly after that uh, same oak, or the, uh, the oak that's sitting over there. Uh, both were freshly cut by my buddy Mike. Well, I got both of them about this time last year. Okay. Um, the oak was the first step I started busting up. And the, uh, a lot of this maple, you guys just saw me split recently. Even, uh, not busted, busted down. The, uh, the rounds were almost dry by the time I got to them. So, seasoning time is vastly shorter. And the BTU value of the oak is not so much higher that it's unreasonable to just use a lot of maple. Sure, you get more BTU value out of the uh, out of the oak, but if you are splitting for yourself, why not use maple? considering it seasons out so much faster. By the way, I am not a professional wood stacker. So, if it's ugly, it gets ugly. As long as it stays up, doesn't fall down on me, I don't care. Any guys that uh, work on saws, small engines, stuff like that, do your own oil changes. I keep a old coffee can 
that I dump waste fuel or whatever you want to call it. If I'm working on a saw and I have to take the caps off and I have to dump the bar oil and fuel out, I dump it into that coffee can. Before I start my fires, I take some of these wood chips and I just let them soak 10-15 minutes and it burns long enough to start just about any size wood I throw in there. It's going to get thrown away anyhow or you know, it's waste that just got reused. I'm not spending money on fire starters or anything else. Um, it's safe enough to use inside because it doesn't uh, flash. The oil and fuel soaks into the wood so it's a slow burn. So you can make your own fire starters. Just be careful how you handle them because again you're, you're dealing with fuel. Oh, welcome back. So, I might be a little bit scatterbrained today, so I feel like I'm kind of all over the place. Got a lot going on, uh, but the reason why I'm stacking wood is, one, I need to get off the ground, but got a lot of leaves all over the place we need to get up. So, not a big fan of picking up leaves, but we do like our trees. So, I gotta get that pile of wood up. I've also got uh, all this sweet gum that uh, I split in the last video that's uh, just kind of sitting here. Need to get that up too. So I'm gonna stack that real quick. I know stacking wood's not the most exciting thing to watch. And I thought Gemma was going to be out here with me, but... Gemma's off doing Gemma things, so here I am doing the wood. We'll be right back. I got a little bit of setup to do.